was no room for building walls in Martin Luther King Jr.'s dream. Instead, he was about building bridges. The son of civil rights leader Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. took a trip to our border today, celebrating his father's I Have a Dream speech, but also calling on the administration to reunite all children who were still separated from their parents. As our attenders reporter Laura Acevedo shows us, King also met with families and U.S. veterans who have been deported. With the border as a background. There is a sense of crisis in the United States and around the globe that my father warned would come if we could not find a way to live together as a common humanity. Martin Luther King III celebrated the 55th anniversary of his father's I Have a Dream speech, calling on elected officials and the administration to reunify all of the remaining separated children. I declare inhumane treatment children and their parents experience when they're torn apart. The separation should not be at all. Ever. King chose to celebrate the anniversary of his father's speech at the border, highlighting the fact that Dr. King fought for similar rights in the 1960s. In fact, you can say that his nonviolent leadership was all about tearing down walls. The King family led a procession from the beach to the top of Borderfield State Park. Then he met with deported veterans, mothers and Haitians along the fence that separates both countries. He gave them words of encouragement. Um, he uh, imparted hope. King also met with a San Diego man who walked with his father in Selma and Chicago. He did today what uh, I know Dr. King would be proud to have heard. We want a better world. We know we can do better. We could tear down these walls. From Borderfield State Park, Laura Acevedo, 10 News. Border Patrol's San Diego sector chief did not speak to the media, but he did send a statement saying that he was, quote, encouraged to hear that he was open to coming back to San Diego sector to visit with me about the Border Patrol mission and border security as a whole.